Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Classified Captures. Today's episode promises to be electrifying and quite possibly heart-stopping. Ready? Let's jump right into it. Starting today's episode is a clip that's had everyone in our studio scratching their heads. What could this be? If I didn't know any better, I'd even suspect it to be the sting of some giant scorpion or the curled-up tail of a very large animal. There's no other way to come up with a perfect description if we can't see the full thing. After watching the initial seconds, we began to speculate about the creature we were about to encounter. Our speculation, however, is short-lived as we're soon introduced to the creature in all its glory. There are many interpretations we could give to this, but the YouTuber responsible for the footage, who is from the channel Unnouns, believes this is footage of something unique, wild, and previously undiscovered, and he just so happens to conveniently capture this while on a solo camping trip in the mountains. As much as we'd love to take his word for it, there are a couple of possibilities here. It could be a person in a costume, perhaps staged for attention and views. Alternatively, someone with more sinister intentions could be stalking the camper and waiting for the right moment to unsettle him. We see no paranormal being here, but we still believe someone dangerous could potentially be stalking him. What do you think? Does it look more like some sort of a hoax or a prank meant to throw us off, or do you believe the young man really encountered something dangerous and scary? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section, we'd really love to hear them. Still on mysterious beings from the forest, take a look at this next trail cam capture. In this image, we see what appears to be a creature with dark fur lurking behind the tree. The subsequent image shows the same entity apparently having moved forward, revealing more of its features. Now we can clearly make out a head and a pair of arms, one in front and one behind, as if it's mid-stride resembling human arm movement during walking. However, it's the third image that truly stands out, showcasing what many who have seen the images believe to be Bigfoot in its full glory. So what do you think? Is this the real deal or not? Tell us in the comments section. In moments of chaos and emergencies, our attention is naturally drawn to the events at hand, such as accidents and injuries. However, some incidents defy explanation and leave us perplexed. This footage captured at an accident site is a perfect example of such a bizarre occurrence. Amidst the chaos of paramedics and bystanders tending to the accident, the camera person's gaze inexplicably fixated on something peculiar in the nearby woods. The scene before us showcases a figure set against a backdrop of trees adorned in autumnal hues of brown and orange. As we zoom in for a closer look, the peculiarities of this entity become apparent. The creature stands in stark contrast to the individuals bustling about at the accident scene. Its pale form, reminiscent of a humanoid, is visible from the waist up, with its lower body concealed by the trees. The striking dissimilarity between this entity and the people attending the accident raises perplexing questions. Is this a vengeful spirit? A spectre returning from the beyond? Did the unfortunate accident draw it to the location? Could it be there to harvest souls? Share your theories and interpretations in the comments section below. Do you believe in zombies? If you answered no to this question, it won't be a surprise. But what if I told you the US government has a foolproof plan to handle a zombie apocalypse it teaches to its new army recruits? Not so weird now, is it? In this footage posted by YouTuber Mr. Illusion, we see what appears to be a strange person walking in the woods, notably without a head and carrying a sickle-like instrument. 
While seeing someone carrying a sickle in the woods might be odd and weird, depending on the woodland area where the person is seen, there's literally no explanation for a headless man moving through the woods. Could this be the proof we have been waiting for concerning the existence of zombies? Many paranormal enthusiasts who saw the footage believe it to be so. There are some who approved it with skepticism, though believing it could be a cleverly orchestrated hoax. Some even pointed out the fact that it looks like a man with his jacket over his head. But the rest of the paranormal community punched holes in this theory, stating that it was indeed a headless man. The good thing about this footage is, it's of great quality and we can all see what's happening within it. Instead of telling you what my personal opinion is, I thought I'd ask you instead. What do you think we are dealing with here? Tell us in the comments section, we'd really love to hear it. This next footage presents us with yet another enigma. A creature that defies easy classification. The individual recording stumbled upon a peculiar entity which left him puzzled. Wanting to have more evidence of his encounter, he filmed it, which is how we have the footage you are seeing on your screen. The creature in question appears to be white and long-necked, with a small body, yet having no legs like a snake, or, given the circumstances, a giant earthworm. Its initial impression is akin to an uprooted germinating plant placed on a car tire. However, closer scrutiny reveals that this being lacks any discernible eyes or visible means of ingestion or defense. With his curiosity piqued, the observer decides to interact with the creature using a stick, and this unusual encounter takes a surprising turn. The creature responds to the stick's touch by opening its mouth, suggesting a heightened sensitivity to tactile stimuli. Further experimentation follows as the recorder gently prods the creature's rear with the stick. Once again, the creature reacts, this time swiveling its entire neck toward the source of the stimulation, as if attempting to bite the stick. No, not as if it actually means to bite. The identity of this bizarre creature remains elusive. Could it be a previously undiscovered species? Perhaps an organism adapted to a unique ecological niche? Or is it something altogether different, defying our understanding of life forms? You tell us. And you know, one more thing. I won't be surprised if one of you actually knows what it is. Our next video, which was uploaded on the channel Seust, certainly presents an intriguing and mysterious object found in a basement. The footage shows a strange black object that appears to be shaking. If you come from where I come from, you'd know that shaking black orbs, like looking at things from the basement, are definitely things you should avoid. But looks like this YouTuber didn't get the memo. Once he uploaded the footage, however, various speculations were offered by viewers, suggesting it could be an egg or even a cocoon. However, without more context or information, it's challenging to definitely identify the object and determine its origin. Do you have any theories or thoughts on what this object might be? Personally, my theories may be too frightening or out of this world to share, but I'd love to hear yours. What do you think this is? Please tell me in the comments section. Have you ever caught an uninvited guest trying to break into your home using the door camera? If you answered yes, did they look like this? Definitely not. The figure in question appears to possess human-like shoulders and arms, which are initially unremarkable. However, a closer examination reveals a striking peculiarity. Its hand, unlike a typical human hand, appears to be twisted and deformed, almost resembling the appendage of a person with a disability. As this mysterious entity continues to navigate through a doorway, its actions become even more confounding. Although the head remains concealed from view, for the most part, as it gradually comes into frame, something truly extraordinary emerges. 
This figure seems to sport a long, elongated snout reminiscent of that of a horse or a dog. The sight is undeniably bizarre and leaves us grappling with a host of questions. What could this entity be? And how can we make sense of its curious combination of human and animal-like features? Is this a mere trick of the camera or something more inexplicable? That we may never find out, but what do you think? The trail cam video you see on your screen captures an eerie and mysterious sight in the middle of the woods. In the early hours of the morning around 3 a.m., a strange mist or smoke-like substance suddenly appears, seemingly emanating from above and right in front of the camera lens. The timing and appearance of this mist create an uncanny and otherworldly atmosphere. It's not uncommon for trail cams to capture unusual phenomena in the wilderness, often sparking speculation and curiosity. Some might interpret this as the breath or presence of a large creature. I mean, look at it. It looks like the steam that comes out of an individual while breathing in a cold and icy region. Only this time, if it's indeed someone exhaling steam, then you and I can tell that someone would have to be very large. Given the fact that this large being or thing is sitting directly above the camera and looking toward the direction of the grazing deer, we can conclude that whatever it is, it's a predator that's interested in consuming the creature. Some have mentioned Bigfoot, others a werewolf, and some others a dogman. What about you? What do you think could be creating that steam from breathing in and out? Tell us in the comment section. Could you have multiple paranormal experiences and impartation without realizing it? Well, our next clip seems to suggest so. <laughs> The YouTube channel BD Ghost Hunter posted this footage online after their crew ventured into the woods to investigate paranormal activities. As the video begins, one of the crew members is seen standing in front of a tree. However, just a few seconds later, a strange yellowish orb appears and disappears. It's followed by another orb, this time a pink one which appears on the other side of his head before also vanishing. It's unclear whether these orbs were reflections from their light or something paranormal. However, as the camera person pans the camera with a flashlight, a creature briefly comes into view, watching them from the shadows among two trees. <laughs> The individuals are either oblivious to the whole thing or don't seem to care much about it. Why you wouldn't care about something like this baffles me. Either they didn't really see it while filming and only saw it when they were reviewing the footage, or the authenticity of the footage is very much questionable. At least, those are our thoughts. What are yours? In the remote wilderness of Alaska, a camper stumbled upon a sighting that has fueled speculation about the presence of the legendary cryptid, the elusive Bigfoot. The footage, taken from a hidden camera nestled among the leaves, offers a glimpse of a creature traversing the woods. At first glance, it's understandable why the camper believes this to be a Bigfoot encounter. The figure in question stands tall, displaying distinctly ape-like characteristics, and remarkably, it appears to be walking on two legs. This aligns with the classic descriptions associated with Bigfoot sightings. Is this another Bigfoot sighting, or are we simply seeing what we want to see and reading meanings into things that don't have such meanings? If you've made it this far and haven't hit the like button, subscribed, or even dropped a comment, could you do that before we go on? Thank you very much. It means a lot. Moving back to today's episode. In a world filled with inexplicable mysteries, this image stands out as one of the most perplexing. Captured in a park, it presents a grotesque sight that defies easy categorization. One might be tempted to liken it to a mummified human head, but the presence of hair covering its entire body suggests otherwise. It's hard to say. When I saw the footage, I initially thought it might be a woman with burn marks sitting on a tree, screaming in pain. 
I mean, it would be strange to capture something like this in the woods, but trail cams capture weird things all the time. I was about to dismiss this whole thing when I saw that it had talons for feet. Can you see it too? All of a sudden, it becomes apparent that the image is not so ordinary. There's some supernatural element to it. Could we be dealing with a witch? Was she injured in transit? Or is the whole thing simply a well-curated hoax? Share your thoughts with us. Next, we have footage from a daring group of YouTubers from the Sharby channel who embarked on an adventure that led them deep into a remote graveyard within a dense forest. Little did they know that they were about to encounter more than they had bargained for. Okay, yo, let's get the f out of here, man. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. No, okay, that's it. Their airy journey commenced with the discovery of an old crowbar lying ominously on the ground. The very sight of this rusty piece of metal seemed to bother them, but they forged ahead regardless. They then discarded the crowbar and dismissed their unease in their bid to enjoy their adventure. As they delved further into the graveyard, their uneasiness only intensified, especially when they stumbled upon an ancient grave dating back to the 1800s. To their bewilderment, the weather took a bizarre turn and it began to snow. In October, a truly unexplicable phenomenon. The most unsettling discovery was, however, yet to come. A peculiar doll was found leaning against a tombstone. Anyone remotely interested in the paranormal or someone who has at least seen horror movies know dolls in eerie places are to be avoided, and our explorers understood that. At that moment, the adventurers could no longer ignore the eerie aura that surrounded them. With a quick and unanimous decision, they made a hasty exit from the unsettling graveyard, leaving behind an enigma that still lingers in their memories. What do you think about the whole thing? Imagine walking into the woods and seeing this staring at you. What would be the first thing to run through your mind? This trail cam capture is eerily reminiscent of the previous image taken in the park. Once again, we're confronted with a bizarre creature, but this time its appearance is even more unsettling. This enigmatic being possesses a peculiar skeletal face and its entire body is shrouded in a thick layer of hair. The creature appears to be standing amid a tangle of bushes, its unblinking gaze fixed directly upon the camera. What can we make of this mysterious entity? What strange force or presence could lead to such an eerie encounter? These questions linger, shrouding this image in an unsettling aura of the unknown. In the dead of night, a lone motorcyclist embarked on a journey through the darkness, a GoPro camera affixed to his head, documenting his every move. Suddenly, the stillness of the night was shattered by the haunting sound of weeping echoing through the air. As he drew closer to the source of the mournful cries, he witnessed a chilling and otherworldly sight, a spectral figure akin to a woman materializing on his right. In a moment of curiosity mixed with fear, he turned his camera toward the eerie apparition, capturing it as it dissipated into nothingness. Did you capture that spine-tingling moment? A humanoid figure, draped in a long robe, vanishes before our very eyes. What could this special entity be? Was it a restless spirit beckoning him towards an unknown destiny, or perhaps something even more mysterious and unfathomable? Here's another intriguing piece of footage that joins the ranks of potential Bigfoot encounters in the wild. In this instance, a hiker exploring the woods stumbled upon a captivating sight. As the hiker ventured through the forest, their attention was drawn to a mysterious figure in the distance. Nestled among the dense foliage, the figure appears to be enveloped in darkness, obscuring its precise features. With a sense of curiosity, the hiker decided to zoom in on the enigmatic presence. Upon closer examination, it became evident that this entity possessed dark fur and a substantial size. Initial thoughts of it being a bear or perhaps a gorilla crossed the hiker's mind. However, the remarkable height of this creature raised intriguing questions. Could it be, as some speculate, a potential sighting of the legendary Bigfoot? 
Like many such encounters, this footage fuels the ongoing debate about the existence of cryptids like Bigfoot. What are your thoughts on this compelling footage? In the serene wilderness of Lolo, Montana, a curious couple embarked on a snowshoeing adventure, a journey that would lead them into the heart of a perplexing mystery. As they traversed the snowy landscape, their eyes fell upon a peculiar set of tracks nestled just beyond the bounds of a small frozen lake. What made these prints truly remarkable was their unconventional nature. They possessed not the customary five toes, but a mere trio of toes. A further twist of intrigue awaited them as they stumbled upon a five-foot-long stick lying nearby, seemingly connected to the enigma of the free-toed tracks. They tried following the tracks, but it led them into the woods, and since it was getting late, they aborted the mission. But you have to wonder, what creature could have left behind those perplexing tracks with only three toes, and was the presence of the stick mere happenstance or intricately linked to this mysterious enigma? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. In the era of trail cam captures, it's customary to expect glimpses of wildlife and the occasional mysterious phenomena. However, there is some footage that transcends the ordinary and ventures into the territory of sheer perplexity. The footage we're about to delve into was a prime example of such an enigma. The scene is familiar. Lush greenery and dense vegetation fill the frame. However, it's the moment within this serene wilderness that captures our attention. From the midst of the trees emerges an unexpected sight, a human figure. But this isn't your typical encounter. The individual in question appears to be a naked man crawling painstakingly across the ground. Naturally, this prompts a series of questions. What could have prompted such behavior? Is there a story behind this bizarre sighting? Unfortunately, the trail camera's owner, like us, was left pondering these mysteries. The fate and motive of this crawling figure remains elusive, leaving us with another chapter in the book of unexplained phenomena. This video was captured in the dead of night, and as the recorder ventured deeper into the woods, feeling he was being followed or watched, he decided to say hello. Hello? Hey, His voice echoes a friendly hello into the darkness, and in response, an eerie sound emanates from somewhere ahead. Through the camera lens, we catch a glimpse of a peculiar white figure. It doesn't appear to have typical physical features. Instead, it seems to be clad entirely in white clothing with holes strategically cut around the eyes for visibility. Suddenly, this enigmatic creature has its attention on the explorer. In an unexpected twist, it seems to dive, reminiscent of a large fish descending back into the sea. It appears as though the creature is attempting to approach the recorder. This sudden movement prompts an immediate reaction from the explorer. He hastily turns the camera away from the creature and, quite understandably, decides to make a run for it. The identity of this mysterious creature remains a puzzle, and the nature of its response to the explorer's greeting adds an element of intrigue to the encounter. What could this creature be, and why did it react the way it did? These questions linger even among members of the paranormal with no certain answers. What do you think? This footage reveals an unknown vicinity which is adorned with lush green groves of trees as the night sky heads towards nighttime. In the far left corner, there's a retreating figure that appears to have humanoid shape, possibly a predator. Without more specific information or visual details, it's challenging to identify the exact species of the retreating figure. It's essential to remember that nature is full of these predator-prey dynamics, and they're part of the natural balance in ecosystems as a deer comes into view, but doesn't seem to be vigilant to evade potential threats. With the actions of the dark figure, could it have been targeting the deer and on its way to capture it? What are your thoughts? <laughs> this
This intriguing footage was captured in Indonesia during broad daylight, offering a glimpse of the vast landscape adorned with tall orange and red-hued buildings. However, the focal point of this video is an enigmatic creature spotted atop a hill. The creature is dark, tall, and seems to lack visible legs, probably due to how far it is. Upon closer inspection, however, this unidentified creature appears to be moving in a manner reminiscent of a snail or a slug, employing a dragging motion. This unusual sight prompts audible reactions from the people in the vicinity. Their voices fill the background with gasps and pleas, likely expressing their concern and curiosity about the nature of this creature. As the creature continues its journey, it gradually disappears into the unknown, leaving viewers with a lingering mystery. What could this furry fellow be, and how did it manage to move without apparent legs? Members of the paranormal community who saw this, however, believe it's a Bigfoot and only lacks discernible legs because of how far it is. What thinkest thou? I told you I wasn't kidding. This video was filmed inside the Mira Mesa tunnel, which appears to be adorned with graffiti artwork, giving it a distinct and artistic character. A group of friends decided to venture into this tunnel on the night of May the 9th. While it was supposed to be your everyday fun walk, they ended up capturing and experiencing a bizarre series of intriguing events. First, they started hearing things and tried to find the individual or being responsible for it. Okay. I told you I wasn't kidding. After a few minutes, they're unable to find anyone and they continue their adventure. Then the disturbance returns again, but this time on both sides of the tunnel. Naturally, those eerie events created a heightened sense of tension and uncertainty. Okay, now we heard it from both sides. All right, let's go. Fearing for their lives, they decided to leave and walk toward the exit. As they reached the end of the tunnel, we see an assortment of items, including a table and various other objects. We are unsure why these are here, but the experience raises intriguing questions. Why go there in the dead of the night? Why go at all? What if there was a strange creature or some venomous snake or something in there? Am I overreacting? Well, maybe I am, but perhaps I should ask you too. Would you venture into such a place in the dead of night? How would you have reacted? Tell us in the comments section, and if you've had such an experience in tunnels, please share as well. Now let's unravel a peculiar sighting that occurred in the vast Canadian mountains. Picture this. A lone hiker surrounded by the breathtaking wilderness stumbles upon an inexplicable scenario. As the hiker's gaze goes down the mountain, a peculiar sight unfolds before them. It's a creature, or at least something that appears to be one. What makes this sighting truly baffling is how it moves. The rock seems to be lifted from beneath as though some unseen force resides beneath the surface. What could be causing this eerie phenomenon? But hold on. The strangeness doesn't stop there. As this mysterious movement inches closer to a backpack resting on the ground, our expectations are defied. Instead of the backpack itself shifting, a sudden gust of wind whips through, making the backpack straps flutter through the air. The movement then passes by the backpack and moves out of sight. What could this be? Some kind of new natural phenomenon or something else we should be concerned about. Have you experienced something like this? Please tell us in the comment section. Check out this intriguing footage shared by TikTok user Merch85. It's not your typical day at the beach, that's for sure. Here's what went down. You've got a group of folks having a blast in the water, just soaking up the sun in the sea. Everything seems perfectly normal until a wave crashes in. That's when things get weird. Before the wave hits, there's this young boy in the scene. But as the wave rolls back out, something unbelievable happens. The boy somehow morphs into a full-grown man. It's like he hit a fast-forward button on his life underwater. 
Now, we're left scratching our heads. Is it some sort of camera trickery, an optical illusion, or a glitch in the Matrix? What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comments. If you still haven't hit the like button, subscribed, or even dropped a comment, could you do it now? Thank you very much. It means a lot to us and allows us to create more content like this. A group of friends embark on an adventure in the scenic mountains of Switzerland. Sounds like the beginning of a great trip, right? Well, it was until they stumbled upon something that defies explanation. What they witnessed was an object hovering by the mountainside, and it wasn't your run-of-the-mill balloon or drone. This thing had no visible strings or propellers, adding an extra layer of mystery to the situation. As they zoomed in for a closer look, it got even weirder. This object appeared humanoid with discernible features like a head, arms, and legs. The group couldn't shake off the airy feeling that this thing had been there all day. Was it a flying human, an extraterrestrial visitor, or something else entirely? Intrigued, they returned the next day, cameras in hand, hoping against hope that it had all been a bizarre illusion. But no, the floating enigma was still there, defying the laws of gravity. Now we're left with more questions than answers. What on earth, or perhaps beyond it, could this be? If you live in the area, maybe you can help shed some light on this puzzling site. Let us know if the mysterious presence in the Swiss mountains still lingers. Imagine being in the comfort of your own home when something inexplicable occurs. That's precisely what happened to the individual who captured this bizarre incident on camera. In the footage, we see a peculiar orb, a mysterious glowing sphere floating around. It seems to move with a sense of purpose, almost as if it's dancing, all while an oblivious cat strolls by. But this isn't an isolated event. Similar orbs have been spotted in various locations worldwide. The big question is, what are these orbs? What could their presence signify? My money is on demonic or spiritual activity. But what's yours? The footage you see reveals mysterious movements in the waters of Telemark, Norway. Do you see it? Water isn't supposed to move like that on its own. While it's difficult to determine the exact cause without more information, there could be various natural or man-made factors at play. It's possible that these movements are caused by underwater currents, schools of fish, or even submerged objects. The sounds of a boat's engine in the background might suggest some human activity in the area, but the absence of a visible boat adds to the mystery. The mention of cellula, which means Selma in Norwegian, adds a layer of folklore to the mystery. In Scandinavian folklore, the Selma is often described as a large serpentine lake creature. Many who saw the footage believe that this Selma is responsible. To truly understand what's happening in the video, it would likely require further investigation and analysis by experts in marine biology or environmental science or fisher folk. Our untrained eyes can't really tell what's going on and we're excited about the possibility of a monster being responsible. We know there are some among you with trained eyes. To such folks we ask, what do you see happening? Presley Belcher, a TikToker with 7,755 followers, is known for creating random TikTok videos, and this particular video is no exception. We see her singing or lip-syncing to a song that isn't audible to the ears while recording herself with a little black spray bottle in her hand as a mic. She momentarily closes her eyes, attempting to convey the emotional impact of the song. All this time, the closed white door behind her can be seen shaking until it opens from the inside. And just like that, it was reflected in the video catching Presley's attention. She appears genuinely frightened, with fear evident in her eyes. 
She turns to confirm that she isn't dreaming, gasps, and covers her mouth upon realizing it is indeed reality. And with that, she gets up to end the recording. This was indeed a bone-chilling moment. What would you have done if you were in her place? Did you notice anything we didn't? Please do share in the comments section. What do you think this is? I don't know about you, but this is giving me alien vibes. If you've ever watched the Predator movie series, you will understand. Whatever this is looks like it just landed from a spaceship and is ready to cause some trouble on the new planet it just landed on. It's clearly a humanoid and appears to have no clothes on. It's fit, slender, and maybe even muscular. Its body is reminiscent of something you will associate with an alien creature. Is it one, though? I'd like to believe so, but what do you think? In this video clip, we see a typical family moment at home with beautifully designed carpets of various colors. In the corner, just behind them, we spot a small and unusual creature. It's cute and black with hair resembling that of an ape or bear. The creature playfully moves before it's revealed to have a string or a thread attached to it. It's held by the speaker, and shortly after the playful movements, the man opens the door and steps outside to remove his shoes, with the creature closely following. All who've seen the creature believe it's a baby Bigfoot. Frankly, I can see it being one, but what about you? Do you see it? When you clicked this video, did you ever think you'd see a baby Bigfoot? Well, there you have it. But what at all will drive someone to tie this little one with a thread? Hmm, and why would you keep a baby Bigfoot? What would you do when it hits adolescence and starts to grow rapidly? What if its family comes searching? If you thought the previous video was wild, then it's clearly because you haven't seen this. In this footage, we see a black furred creature being gently lulled to sleep. As if that's not already weird enough, a few seconds into the video, it appears to be working. The small creature has human-like hands, complete with black-colored nails. The creature's fingers appear smaller than those of a human. Its face has a cream and pinkish complexion, and its eyes opening and closing reveal black pupils. It's making a valiant effort to stay awake as if wanting to have the last laugh rather than succumb to sleep. What species of creature is it, though? You might be tempted to say monkey and ape, and while you might not be too far from the truth, I beg to differ. If you asked me, I'd say it does resemble a baby Bigfoot. Wouldn't you agree? This fortunate homeowner managed to grab their camera just in time to witness a truly awe-inspiring, albeit frightening, display of nature's power. It all started with a heavy storm brewing on the horizon. Dark clouds gathered ominously, and rain began to pour like a torrent. Then, in an instant, a blinding bolt of lightning cracked the sky. The target of this electrifying spectacle? A massive tree. As the lightning struck, a brilliant burst of flame erupted around the point of impact. It was as if nature had decided to put on a spectacular show, and it did so with breathtaking yet terrifying displays of its sheer force. This footage serves as a powerful reminder of the immense power that nature wields, capable of both astonishing beauty and devastating destruction. It leaves me both terrified and excited. What about you? A family enjoying their time on their remote wooded property got an unexpected surprise when their vigilant dog alerted them to something in their backyard. 
Intrigued and perhaps a little anxious, they ventured over to investigate the source of their dog's excitement. What they encountered left them both intrigued and somewhat unsettled. There, amidst the trees and darkness, they noticed a pair of eyes peering back at them. These eyes blinked and darted about, suggesting that whatever they belonged to was moving stealthily among the trees. The question that now loomed over them was this. What could possibly be lurking in the woods? Was it merely some harmless nocturnal creatures going about their business, or was there something more enigmatic and potentially sinister concealed within the depths of the forest? The answer remains shrouded in the mystery of the woods. Amidst a field teeming with overgrown produce, we have a capture that's bound to tickle your imagination. Imagine setting up your trail cam footage and coming across this image. There isn't much to dissect, just a multitude of plants and a black furred creature standing beside a tall plant. The creature's head sports a slightly elongated top, and its expression appears rather stern as if nothing humorous has crossed its path in its lifetime. This capture is impressive, but the creature's identity remains uncertain. Is it just an ordinary ape-like creature going about its day, or are we dealing with something more, perhaps a Bigfoot? It's hard to say, but my money is on it being a Bigfoot. What say you? In this clip, we have a group of friends out in the woods having fun and recording the whole thing. They seem to have set up a makeshift basketball court in the woods surrounded by their parked cars. If you pay attention right, to the audio, you'll realize that beyond their laughter, like a there's a shrill sound in the background. <laughs> it's almost as if there's some weird or wild creature out there. The person behind the camera points this out and begins walking toward the woods. At that moment, he spots a creature resembling an ape casually walking on its two feet moving through the woods. As expected, it startled both him and his friends. I mean, it's not every day you see a giant of a beast casually walking through the woods. The person filming attempts to get closer for a clearer look, but his friends discourage him from doing so. I see it back there. I'm What could they have run into? You don't need to be an expert in the paranormal to know that the creature is most definitely Bigfoot. But one question looms. Is that the real deal, or are we looking at someone in a costume? Well, I think I'll let you decide on this one. As the camera rolls, we hear the voice of a foreign man who appears to be on a quest to capture evidence of some mysterious sightings he's encountered. In his haste to capture a potential eureka moment, he sprints across a well-manicured grass field, camera in hand, capturing every step. Further ahead, a mysterious structure emerges in the middle of the unknown vicinity. However, as he turns, we catch a glimpse of glowing lights and a lurking presence behind the structure. It has a ghostly form, and it's unlike any otherworldly cryptid or paranormal entity we have encountered. Do you see it too? Do you know what creature this is? If you do, please share it with us in the comments section. Next, we have a trail cam that captured a rather bizarre creature roaming the woods at an ungodly hour. Amidst a thick canopy of green leaves, broken branches, and slanted tree trunks, the camera captures a ghostly figure clinging to shattered boughs. With an appearance reminiscent of century-old cobwebs, almost like a wraith with its gray face resembling a smoke-filtered mask, it lacks eyeballs but possesses empty eye sockets, wooden hands with only two fingers, black fur, and visible front teeth. If I ever encountered something like this in real life, I might just be scared out of my wits. But the question remains, is it even real? If it is, why is it roaming the woods? What happened to it? How did it become like this? 
Has any one of you encountered anything like this, or at least heard stories or legends about creatures like this? If you have, could you please share? We'd really like to know. Two of my favorite words I would never thought I'd see together, a river and a wolf. But here I am about to show you footage of a river wolf. If my intro had you thinking we were going to see a giant canine with webbed feet, etc, etc, well, I apologize. But you have to agree the creature on your screen is quite the specimen. What you see on your screen is none other than the giant otter. Believe it or not, that creature is considered an apex predator in its region in the Amazon rainforest. It's capable of growing up to the length of six feet. It's a skilled hunter that's even capable of hunting down juvenile caimans. While smaller than alligators and crocodiles, caimans are no pushovers and the fact that these creatures are capable of hunting them down makes them intriguing and dangerous at the same time. Have you ever encountered one of these creatures? Let us know in the comments section. Did that scare you? Well, if it did, I won't be surprised. The creature looks like something straight out of a nightmare and it has limbs that don't quite make sense. The video is blurry, hence we can't say much, but it might have scales for skin and generally have a fish-like appearance. These guesses are based on the description of the uploader who called the creature a toil. For those unfamiliar with it, it's a supernatural creature or spirit found in the Southeast Asian folklore, particularly in Malay, Indonesian and Thai cultures. It's often described as a mischievous and malevolent creature that's associated with black magic and the occult. It's commonly depicted as a grotesque or deformed fetus-like creature. It's typically very small in size, resembling an infant or a small child. Here's the twist. It's believed to have the power to bring wealth and good fortune to its owner if treated well, but it can also bring misfortune if mistreated. Most often, however, it carries out the wishes of a master, which leaves us wondering, did someone intentionally send the creature after the family? If they did, why? Why would you do such a thing? With recent announcements in the USA about aliens, footage of possible sightings have been emerging, and this next clip is no exception. Have a look. In the clip, we see a young man moving up and about in his home. He steps out, and we see that his home is closer to the woods than it is to the city. Taking a critical look at the footage, however, we see what looks like a light source from a distance. As the camera stabilizes, we realize that it's no light source at all. Instead, it appears to be the head of some strange creature. The one recording calls out to it and asks what it wants, but his query goes unanswered. At this point, it's easy to tell that it's no ordinary person or creature. We're actually dealing with some sort of alien. The alien creature doesn't respond to the boy or move towards him. Instead, it walks away uninterested. Was it searching for a specific specimen that the young man didn't fit? Or could it have been deaf, explaining its lack of response to the shouting? Or am I simply overthinking this? Share your thoughts with me in the comments section. What do you want? What the fuck? Why are you walking away? Where the fuck is it going? Holy shit. Holy crap, I haven't seen that fucking close before. We've had weird trees in today's episode, but this next one is my favorite, and once you see it, you'll understand. As you can see, this tree doesn't look grotesque, nor does it look scary. Instead, it looks like one of my favorite mythological creatures of all time, a dragon. And what's more, you can actually try to kiss it. But how could a tree take the shape of a dragon? And no, this isn't a case of pareidolia, at least not for me. What could account for this tree's strange growth formation? All other trees in the area look normal. 
What if, and this is a big what if, but what if an actual dragon was cursed and transformed into a tree? I know it's a big stretch, but after everything we've seen on this channel, of which you consider that an impossibility, think about it. Next, we have another chilling capture that unveils an otherworldly creature that defies comprehension. Think I'm exaggerating? Well, take a look. This still image was captured on a trail camera situated deep within a mysterious forest, one akin to the Dark Forest Harry Potter series. It reveals a massive, deformed creature with four legs and a tail. Taking a second look, you realize that the creature appears to have two heads. One faces the camera with its mouth agape, while the other gazes in a different direction. As if all these were not weird enough, the creature is also very muscular with its physique resembling that of a bodybuilder. Either way, we have many questions about this creature and its origin. Is it the result of an experiment gone wrong? Is it an otherworldly creature materializing in our plane? Is it an AI generation meant to throw us off? We simply can't put our finger on it. What do you think it is? I wish I could say this next clip isn't any weirder, but that would be a lie. This footage was captured by an adventurous individual in an unfamiliar locale. As he was exploring, he stumbled upon a spot behind a weathered white wall adorned with faded black writings. The location had grass sporadically covering the ground and vibrant trees with green leaves surrounding the area. While filming, the explorer noticed a strange humanoid figure in a squatting posture, seemingly lost in whatever it was doing. However, the recorder's actions break the cover and draw the creature's attention. With its white, pale, like ghostly-looking self, it charges towards the one filming. This causes the video to end abruptly, leaving much to the imagination afterwards. What do you think this creature was? My money is on the fact that it's a rake, but what about you? Stepping away from the creature, however, tell us what you would have done if you found yourself in this predicament. Let us know in the comments section. Next, we have a capture that doesn't give away much of its surroundings except a tall figure right before the camera, revealing what might seem to be a cryptid or an alien. With a physique resembling that of a human, this creature sure does give me the creeps. Turquoise blue in color with glowing eyes and a chest area resembling cocoa in shape, it possesses long arms, fingers, and legs. Its nose and mouth resemble that of an anteater with distinct lines showcasing its unique features, setting it apart from otherworldly creatures we've encountered. Notably, detailed bone structures protrude from various parts of its body, suggesting it may not have had a substantial meal for quite some time. What do you think this is? Are we staring at a possible Halloween custom-made costume, or should we be wary going out in the dead of night? If it's no Halloween costume, could this really be an alien? I can't say with certainty, but well, I wouldn't be surprised if it is. Are there Bigfoots in Ohio? If you thought, well, no, then this next footage will truly prove you wrong. In this capture, we see a mysterious figure amidst a sprawling forest with black and white leaves, protruding branches, and visible grass. Though unclear what this may be at first glance, closer inspection leaves no doubt. This is none other than Bigfoot. It's huge, towering as tall as a tree, covered in thick black fur, and in its right hand, could it be? Bigfoot on the run with a baby? It seems like history may be repeating itself, a tale of a human baby raised among animals mirroring the story of Tarzan. Tarzan too, perhaps. It's hard to say, but what do you think the probability of this happening is? Do you even see what I see at all? Let me know in the comments section. If you've made it this far and haven't hit the like button, subscribed, or even dropped a comment, could you do that before we go on? Thank you very much, because it means a lot. Moving back to today's episode. Now, this is one of those photos that will make you do a double take. 
Here's the story. This lady was out in the woods recording a video minding her own business and unaware of what was lurking behind her. But let's dive into the creepy part. If you zoom in on the image, right there amidst a pile of dried leaves, you'll spot it. A creature with an extremely pale face and those dark, hollow eyes. Your first instinct might be Bigfoot, right? Well, not so fast. Bigfoots, if they exist, aren't usually this ghostly pale. So what are we dealing with here? The possibilities are enough to send shivers down your spine. It could be a skinwalker, a rake, or perhaps something even more sinister. What we do know is, if that creature was still hungry, this lady might have been on the menu. It's a chilling reminder that those woods can be a mysterious and unpredictable place. So next time you're out there, keep your wits about you. Apart from the mysteries of Bigfoot, many things also leave the internet stuck in awe and confusion. One such intriguing footage was captured by a UK-based YouTuber known for his channel, Exploring with Danny. Danny, known for his explorations of abandoned places, recently ventured into an abandoned church. Little did he know this visit would take an unexpected turn. I'll not say much, I'll let the video speak for itself. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Maybe Danny didn't get the memo of the word abandoned, but that strange pale person in the footage just gave him enough of a reminder to send him running away. What's your take on this video? Do you think it was staged? Or did Danny genuinely encounter something unexpected? Judging from his reaction, it looks like he had quite the scare. But is it authentic, though? I'll let you decide that. Still on the bizarre and spooky, hold onto your hat, folks, because things just took a turn for the downright bizarre. Feast your eyes on this enigma caught by a trail cam. We've got a green, scaly-looking thing. I say thing because it's hard to even classify this one. It appears to have two tentacle-like appendages, which I guess might be legs. But there's no head, no discernible features, and frankly, it looks like something straight out of a sci-fi flick. It's even hard to believe this was captured on a trail cam. Just when you thought you'd seen it all, the universe throws this curveball your way. If there are things like this lurking in the woods, maybe staying indoors isn't such a bad idea after all. Speaking of which, perhaps I need to cancel that camp meeting I never wanted to go to. Well, folks, if you thought Danny's video was a little spooky, wait till you see this one. This cat owner was just minding his own business and taking cute snapshot of his furry friend. Sounds like a harmless and fun activity, right? But when he later checked the photo, things took a creepy turn. Right there in the background, amidst the dark woods, you can spot a pair of glowing eyes. Now, we all know nocturnal animals have eyes that reflect light, especially at night. But these eyes have that extra dash of eeriness, don't they? It's like they're sending chills down your spine, or am I the only one feeling those chills? Either way, you have to wonder what could those eyes belong to. Some might say it's just a regular nocturnal critter, but there's always that lingering possibility, isn't there? That possibility that it might be something straight out of a campfire ghost story, like the infamous Dog Man. Perhaps my imagination is running wild again, but what do you folks think? Regular animal or something more mysterious? Let's hear from you. This next footage was taken by the security guards from a school in Brazil. It was pretty late at night when they heard a loud banging sound coming from the school building, so two of the guards set out to investigate. As they approach, they notice something else eerie. The lights are flickering ominously. The tension is thick in the air as they venture deep into the school, drawn by the unexplained sounds. But here's the kicker. Just as suddenly as it started, the noise abruptly ceases and the lights go out. 
These vigilant guards check every nook and cranny, inspect the lights, and even examine the fuses, but they find nothing amiss. So what could have caused this chilling disturbance? Was it a mischievous ghost, or perhaps something far more sinister lurking in the shadows? In this footage, we can see a pile of leaves around a hollow spot in the middle of the woods. Tell me, what do you see lurking in the shadows among the leaves? I've got my money on a face, but hey, you know what your creative minds will come up with. All right, folks, time to take a breather from all this brain teaser. Ever heard of the word pareidolia? It's a quirky phenomenon where our brains spot familiar patterns in completely unrelated things, like seeing a smiley face in a slice of toast or a dragon in the clouds. I believe you experienced such when you checked out the footage. The uploader of the footage suspects that there's a Bigfoot in there, but I have a question. Based on your own experience trying to identify whatever is in the footage and your newly found knowledge of the phenomenon, what do you think is really happening in there? Share your thoughts with me in the comments section. Say you decided to take keeping fit seriously, and with that, you wake up extra early to fulfill that dream. But upon reaching the gym about to start, you hear creaking sounds. Curious about the sounds, you check it out, but you meet a gym machine moving without anyone on it. What would you do? This footage captures a scene in a quiet neighborhood adjacent to a parking lot where a red car is parked. However, the focus of the video is on a black gym machine that is in inexplicable motion as though a spectral presence is using it for a workout. The machine moves in a manner that suggests a human-like effort to engage in physical exercise. As we all can see, however, there's no one there. Could a ghostly being be responsible for what we are seeing, or is there a more logical explanation for the whole thing? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section, we'd really love to hear them. This footage was captured near Nevada's Nellis Air Force Base in the morning sky when the recorder spotted a white flying object. Upon closer examination, it's clear that this isn't an airplane. It lacks typical aircraft features and has a distinct tic-tac or pill-like shape. It's gliding through the atmosphere at an incredibly fast pace dominating the daytime sky. This can only be one thing, another UFO sighting. Experts were consulted, and they unanimously concluded that it was not an airplane. They described it as chunky, ruling out any conventional aircraft. When comparing this footage to the recorder's other airplane videos, the distinct shape of this object, along with the absence of typical aircraft features, highlights the stark difference. Is this a UFO? Tell us what you think. In the heart of a lush and tranquil forest, an intrepid explorer embarks on a journey to document the wonders of nature. As they delve deeper into the woods, the camera captures the beauty of sun-dappled foliage and the symphony of birdsong that fills the air. Unbeknownst to the explorer, an extraordinary encounter awaits them on this ordinary day. They approach a towering tree, its gnarled roots seemingly rooted in centuries of secrets. As the camera pans towards it, a sudden rustle of leaves and twigs draws their attention to the tree's shadowy side. From behind the ancient tree emerges an enigmatic figure bathed in the muted hues of the forest. Standing at approximately seven feet in height, the creature's form possesses an eerie skeletal quality reminiscent of a macabre marionette. Its face, more simian than human, lacks the softness of flesh appearing as if it was stripped down to its skeletal foundation. The figure extends a bony, elongated arm toward the camera, its fingers reaching out tentatively as if guided by a distant memory. The gesture hints at past encounters with other explorers, leaving an unspoken question in the air. What creature is this? What secrets lie hidden within these woods? Why is it trying to stop the filming? Why isn't it trying to hurt them? So many questions. I don't want to believe this is a hoax. I want to believe there's a cool cryptid out there who isn't interested in hurting or running from us. Is that too much to ask? Either way, that concludes today's episode of Classified Captures. 
If you have any trail cam footage you'd like the rest of the world to see, please send it over to us at classifiedcaptures at gmail.com. Don't be shy and don't think it's crazy. We'll help you make sense of even the most bizarre of captures. What's more, we'll give you the credit unless you want to remain anonymous. What are you waiting for? Send it in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as it helps us out a ton. See you in the next one.